A new photo could mean new leads in the Kyron Horman case. Today, investigators released a new age progression image of the missing boy. He would be 14 years old. The release of this photo coincides with National Missing Children's Day. KGW's Kylie Boshi spoke with Kyron's mom today, along with investigators. Kyle. Kyron's mother hopes that people will share this new age progression photo. Take another look. Investigators believe this is what Kyron Horman would look like today at age 14. Horman disappeared on June 4th, 2010. He was last seen at Skyline School in Northwest Portland. He's never been found. In addition to the new age progression photo, Kyron's face appears on billboards around the state. Lamar Advertising, in cooperation with the FBI, posted the new billboards. Today, I sat down with Horman's mother, Desiree Young. We talked about the search for her son and this new photo. I want people to share it, to post it on social media, to print it, to take it places, post it up. Police have confirmed this is still a very active, ongoing investigation. Yes. What is your sense? I am uh, really optimistic. We have a great law enforcement team uh, in place right now that has been working really hard on a lot of different aspects of it. and. I think that that uh, that's critical, and I think that when you look at it from uh, the perspective that they are now, as a long-term case, long-term missing case, uh, there's different things you have to focus on, and I think that they're taking those uh, positions now. We're coming up on seven years. It's hard to believe seven years. I know. I every time I hear it out loud, it's. Seven years. I would have never told you that we would be here. Um, talking to my husband that day on the drive up, I just knew that we were going to get the call and everything was going to go back to normal. <laughs> normal, whatever that is. And seven years. I can't believe it. Police are encouraging anyone with information about Kyron's disappearance to call. They just need that one good lead. They're offering a $50,000 reward in the case. Back to you. Oh, what happened to that little boy? Thank you so much, Kyle.